Hello YouTube fans, here again and I want to talk about one of these films that being Russ Mathers, Fitzgerald, that's why right, Fitzgerald, come out in 1997, come out I sorry to say in 1968, that's right 1968 and it was sort of like a soft erotic film, now this in its day was a very taboo film, very taboo film Story history and everything, because we've been about it, this was the first film so incest, that's right, too much buffery and sisterly love there, and it was very unpredictably correct, because the buffer has a mate, different race, use a nicer word, and um, some of the words are very racist, let's just say that, so it's very unpredictably correct. So we've got incest, you've got a bit of nudity with this pretty looking dirty, you got a lot. Now, Russ Mathis, as we know, when well, I got sipped up with the 70s, because he did a lot in the 60s, 70s and so on, he did a lot of these films. I'm going to talk about Russ Mathis before, whether it be Up, whether it be The Fire of the Fixons, whether it be Super Fixons and so on. And so he's very good at doing these sort of like soft, sort of rotted, bonking comedy films right and so we did this now the dirt here very attractive dirt not dirt anymore so they say it's getting on but this dirt here i uh, met the, the girls that starred in another film by russ mathis that being um pussy tap of the dolls kill 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 and the girls were called the pussy tap dolls kill 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 one of the ones that made the main character the fire is dirt to star in the next russ mathis film that being this film, Fitzsons, and the rest is history. So it's still, you've got the idea, he's very mysterious, he's very sexy, active, he's married. There's a funny bit where he's doing this sexy dance in a bar, he's got a fish. That there, what's his holding, isn't a snake, it's a fish. Not them big fish when you go fishing and you get Todd, and he's had to do a bit of fishing. So he's dancing about, both to do this erotic dance, he's sucking a fish's head and it just comes across being very laughable but there's a the funny bit where she's dancing about with a fish you see here that's all look a bit on the back there's a little bit of van van fighting man so also too much but it does have features yeah but it's the uncut one and um so on so you like I say you've got the buff and there's a bit of incest which i'm surprised you got away with for that error um you're going into it for bonky you're not going to get a lot it's 1968 come on but you do get a lot of nude stuff on this beautiful dirt here and you do get a biography with her in it so as i say it's not pretty anymore she doesn't look like that anymore and she's talking a bit about the film talk a bit about the film so if you like the history of biographies the original trailer from this film it was very x-rated for its time i remember seeing the original making very warm sir so. And um, she's talking a bit about the brother's mate and because he's a different race and some of the words what was used was unpredictably correct. <laughs> Let's just put it as that without me saying them. And she did, at the time, she did not know there was very racist words. So when she realised as this went on, that those words were very racist. She did feel a bit ashamed of saying them, even though it was her character. Um, so you've got to die, he's peed off with her because she's always winding him up. She meets another guy, he's an Irish fella, and there's a bit in it where he's holding them a prisoner, they find a dead airplane. The guy thinks his wife is pretty and innocent, she's anything but. Basically, born it nice, this is a bit of a slut. She's a bit of a slut, she feeps around, she feeps with anybody she sees, she's very to mysterious. Funny bit, like I could say, she's dancing with a fish. <laughs> so, Russ Mathis definitely made a good one here, it's not like a typical sex comedy there. Came out in the late 60s, that being Fixons. So it's not a bad thing. It's not a bad thing. I'd say they get away, they have an airplane and that's it. The bad guy gets arrested. You've got this innocent smile. Her husband thinks he's sudden and sweet. Just anything but. She gives us this cheeky smile. And basically, it's the end of the film. Like I say, the uncut one, not bad thing if you like Russ Mathis and like i say it come out in 1968 it's a good one it's a good one so you get the original trailer you've got posters you've got so yeah apart from the shower to apologize for that um but yeah it's not a bad one this like i say it's been remastered and um it's the uncut one so yeah it's a good one like i say a lot of biography about this film it's died a good one from 1968 so what else can I say about it? Yeah with it. 
an eight star rating it's a classic like i say it come out in 1968 it's about a dud one she is really beautiful in that era and this is the other way i watched her i think you know it's got dark black hair and i actually went for deals with black hair after seeing this i actually went with deals with black hair very beautiful to look at sad to say she doesn't look like that anymore but yeah if you like films from that sort of era check it out that's fictions into them be smart be safe and I'll see you later for some more movies and more movie reviews.